Hey, how you doing? Today we're talking about thyroid parathyroid surgery. If you're watching this, that means I operated on you or someone else did and forgot to give you instructions. Here we go. Now, thyroid surgery, surgery in your neck. So if you have an incision in your neck, this is you're at the right spot. Parathyroid is for high calcium, thyroid is for a nodule or cancer. Pretty much after the surgery, you're going to be sore. It's going to hurt to turn your neck left or right. That's normal. You're going to have difficulty swallowing. That's normal. You're going to have difficulty breathing sometimes when you cough, especially. That's normal. That will all get better minute by minute, hour by hour after surgery. It pretty much will be gone within 24, 48 hours. You want to watch the incision to make sure it's not swelling. If you have a drain in place, watch the drain output. Thyroid patients get better. The one thing that you need to watch out for is tenderness in your fingers, numbness in your fingers, or numbness at the side of your lip. That usually means that your calcium is low. That could be for thyroid surgery or parathyroid surgery. If that's the case, give us a call. We need to get you on medicine. What we'll do is just start you on Tums over the counter and see if that helps and order labs pretty much the next day or as med immediately after you call us. It's an urgency, not an emergency, unless you wait two or three days. So call us as soon as you can. You have Dermabond over the incision, so you can take a shower, wash your neck without any problems, don't scrub it. Don't put bacitracin or any petroleum jelly on it because it will take that super glue off. Dermabond is basically super glue. But otherwise, it's pretty straightforward. Just take it easy with swallowing foods for the first 24, 48 hours. If you have a lot of swelling in your neck, give us a call. If you have that numbness and tingling, give us a call. If you have a drain, had a drain in place, you'll have a hole where we removed it before you left. Kind of keep that dry for 24, 48 hours. Put a band aid over it or a gauze over it just to make sure that the drainage is caught and it doesn't stain your clothes and don't go swimming. I'll put some general stuff up. You'll see a list. Otherwise, watch out for neck swelling, numbness. Give us a call. Thanks for rocking with us. We appreciate it. Take care.